Hello guys, okay, welcome back. I've got another one of those annoying things, uh, one of the things in The Witcher where you might be getting a little bit stuck or you might be uh, unsure of what to do next. There's a part of the main story where you have to go and re uh, recruit all these people and one of these guys is Hjalmar. Now you will, uh, you'll be sent to go get him to try and help him do a mission uh, where he has to find the the giant, the ice giant of, of Unvik. We'll go into your secondary missions, your side quests. You'll get to this point, uh, but you have to help him, so go uh, find him in the side quest. The Lord of Unvik is the mission you want, that's on the top right, just under the mini-map there. And you get to this point where you go, well, what the hell do I do next? I searched around in this yellow circle again for so long, not knowing what to do. I followed these red tracks, didn't know what to do. Okay, so you need to come through the building. The, the building's quite interesting in itself, it's a bit of a murder scene, it's quite horrible. Uh, but there's these giant footprints, these red footprints that you can see when you, in, when you use your Witcher Sense. And you follow them to this location, keep going, and suddenly they go up a cliff, I think, in a minute. Um, but this again, I, again, this is one of those things where it was not obvious what to do. It was really frustrating. Because where you have to follow the map, the map tells you to go to that place back there, that building uh, where we just were. And you come here, and uh, you've got these footprints up the cliff. Well, yeah, you can't climb the footprints. Uh, you can't climb the cliff yourself. So as Geralt says here, no, I need to find another way. You do. What you uh, If you can try and make your way up that cliff by going around to the left and up again, you'll come to this bit. It seems to be uh, something of interest, and it is of interest, but we'll come back to that later. You cannot get in this way, and I did try many, many times. What you need to do is follow and keep going down the hill um, to a village, which is close by. If you look on the main map, you'll find it. You'll see it on the map. You need to come to this village. It's nowhere near where the arrow is telling you to go, but watch carefully on the map. Uh, as soon as we get near to uh, what looks like an attack by harpies, um, the 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 little uh, the symbol will change, and you see it says help now help the stranger drive off not harpies sirens, and that's what you do. Okay, with sirens, as I've, as I've probably told you in another video, just knock them down out of the air uh, with your uh, with your your telekinetic blast. I can't remember the name of it. Knock them down. You'll be able to stab them on the ground, and then suddenly you get to talk to this guy who was defending himself from them. Well, guess what? As you see this nice little cutscene, and you've been looking for this guy probably for hours, like I did. Um, he reveals himself to be the very dude you are looking for. <laughs> Thanks, white one. If not for you, that might have taken me much longer. And I need to see Lake. That bitch has nearly ripped his innards out. And we two are all that's left of my crew. All right. You might not have heard. I'm Yalmar on Craig. There you go. He's Yalmar. He's the guy that you were trying to find. So just follow the cutscene and uh, follow the prompts. And eventually you'll be following him to this point uh, on that cliff. Very close to where you were, um, with that place you couldn't get in that I showed you. And this is basically opening. You have to help him to open this place up. Don't worry, you'll get through that. Not a problem. Now, he's after this giant. This is what um, it told you to do as one of the things you need to do. Before you can progress, go find Siri. On the Isle of Mist, this is what you need to to get. This is where you need to get to. You have to ask this guy if he can help you. Um, now, this is a pretty cool scene, which is why I've kind of kept it in the video. Um, the the sticky bit's done. You you kind of got past that tricky bit, which I thought was quite annoying of the game not to make that more obvious. However, if you're looking for this video and you found that helpful, uh, you'll come to this point. And you're supposed to. Uh, this guy's been trapped by the giant inside. Well, this wooden frame thing. And you get a choice to whether leave him there, let him free, let free him. Uh, well, I chose to to free him, uh, as I think you'll see in a second. If I could just press the button, Let's free him. there you go. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay, so this guy's a bit of a nutcase. Um, and what you're supposed to do now, as it, say, as it says, find the key to Vigi, who that's his name, Vigi's cave, using your witch's senses. And I can see it over there. But what I didn't see at the time is avoid snow. The sound of cracking under your feet will wake that giant up. Well, what did I do? I ran straight into the snow, waked him up straight away. Uh, not the best thing to do, but of course, you've got options. Now, this giant uh, is a little tricky. I was a reasonably high level when I took it on, so maybe it wasn't as bad as it could have been. Um, but the best thing for ice giants, well, what do you think is going to hurt an ice giant? Yeah, Igni. Use the Igni sign. Uh, I'd leveled it up quite a bit. And look how much damage it does to him. You can just set him on fire and run away. And you can see how much damage he's done. He's, 
pretty powerful and he will damage you even even though I was high level uh, it hurt me so uh, remember to use the the dodge the roll whatever you need to do as as normal with larger beasts uh, but I quite like this cutscene so uh, I'll probably just let you watch this I might I might stop talking I might come back mm. Oh yes, so there you go, you really gotta dodge this. I didn't actually get hit by it, but I bet you that will take, you almost kill you if you get caught by it. But the way, when he's dragging it back, as you saw there a second ago, it didn't actually hurt me, so I think it's only that initial strike um, that he'll hurt you on. But you get plenty of warning, you've just gotta time it right, roll out the way or dodge. I think roll is the best option, and finished him off with a final stab. But look at this, this is great. Right across the belly is beautiful but kind of disgusting at the same time and there you go ice giant defeated hope that was helpful guys and uh, and if you were stuck uh, then uh, this video would have been useful if you weren't stuck you've already got past it then I just hoped you enjoyed it um, please remember to hit the like button that would do me a real favor and uh, please subscribe if you're new thanks a lot guys I will be back soon with more thanks a lot and good night